Now here comes the punting unit. You know, punters really do know how to party, Bricks. Yeah? Oh, yeah, I have pictures that, uh, do, well, maybe actually shouldn't discuss this on here. The return man catches the bam. Say goodnight to that guy, Bricks. Ah, uh, goodnight to that guy, Bricks. You're an idiot. First and ten. And they're picking up chunks of yards now. Nice reception for ten yards. Second down, the size of Bricks Wiener. And the defense just called the ginormous dirty trick. At this rate, the QB is going to have more interceptions than complete. He is. His cleats are caked in blood and guts, and he's looking to score. First and ten. That's the way to move the chains. That's good for a first down. This game is all about momentum and killing. And it's first and ten. And he's off to the races. Look at that little mutant run. Uh, I don't think you can say that. Boo, baby, I'm the greatest. No, you didn't see it because I'm too fast. <laughs> Don't want to make any mistakes here. Just kick the ball through the upright, for God's sake. Straight through the uprights. When you give up points, you need to get them back. Here comes the kickoff. Let's see if they can make them pay. <laughs> and it's first and ten. And then it's a first down from a great catch. Oh, man, he just went off the rails of a crazy train and murdered that guy. Gotta love it. He should bite his head off for an encore win. First and ten. And he snatches that one out of the air for a first down. See if they can get something going here. And it's first and ten. Hot, hot one, hot two, hot. And that pass play is good for eight yards. Second down and two. Hot, hot one, hot two. And I've had it. I'm running out of excuses for this QB. You just pow! And how about a little dirt sandwich? Come 
on, man. You can't hang with me. You get my grill, I'm gonna ruin your world. You understand me? And it's first and ten. A good run for five yards. Hey, didn't move the changes, Gordon, did it? How good can it be? Second down and five. Cereal, the old nut crunch. Now the offense is running low on running backs. They have only two left. They need to conserve those runners now and consider passing more. And it's first and ten. Oh, he just got crushed. The offense calls a timeout. This is why you save your timeouts. You can use them in the two-minute warning. Now I get it. Makes sense, Grim. Second down in a very lot. Well, that's two timeouts burned. And you have to wonder, Bricks, are they desperate or are they in control? Yeah, I'm speaking from experience, Grim, but it really is hard to do both at the same time. And I have mastered it. And that's the way you do it. Eat up chunks of yards with pinpoint passing. And the defense quickly calls a timeout. They want to get the ball back. Most kickers should be able to make this one. But will this kicker make it? Find out next time on NFL Game Day. Straight through the uprights. No! The home team is feeling confident as they get the kickoff into the air. Scoring makes anyone confident. It certainly does, Bricks. It certainly does. High five! And it's first and ten. Remember, folks, in the NFL, you are allowed to touch the quarterback, just like that. <laughs> Second down and more than the QB would like. And the quarterback throws another pick. He should have eaten his sleeties this morning. That, my friends, was an all-pro NFL hit. <laughs> the quarterback goes into a hurry-up offense. He's looking for a quick score. Aren't we are, Grim. Aren't we are. And he zips that one in there for a touchdown. It should be easy, but with kickers, you never know. It's good. Let's see if they can keep the momentum going and keep these fans happy and uh, or bloodthirsty, whichever. Leaving a wake of destruction in his path. The burn returner was maimed by the opposing team, so it's up to the next man to replace him. Yeah, what exactly is a burn returner, Grim? You now, players who catch kickoffs and punts and run them back through the teeth of the defense. They have the lowest survivability rate of any player in the league. The next man.
And the offense goes into a hurry up to pick up the pace of the game. He refuses to, and like Bricks' bowels, he is loose and heading for the end zone. He could go all the way. Yo, man, nobody can touch you an eyeball. I take all you mutants out. That's right. What you talking about? Well, a little chip shot here, extra point, but this guy could blow it. The kick is good. As expected, those are pretty much just gimmies. When you get knocked down, you got to get right back up and fight. Uh, what about when you get knocked up? What do you do then? Run. And he breaks away. It's a close battle as the quarter ends. Halftime is brought to you by those caring folks at Monsatan Industries. They make the world a better place by making the government tell you it is. It's anyone's game as the third quarter begins. Both teams have taken their performance-enhancing drugs, and everyone is ready to rock and roll. The teams line up for the second-half kickoff. <laughs> Here comes the kickoff. Let's see if the defense can hold them. Not a bad kick, but not a great one either. Well, his nickname is Lukewarm. And he's proud of that? Yeah, that's why he named his clothing company Lukewarm Threads. They're marketing. Oh, my God, a man from prison just came out of the field. That's the ref, you idiot. Let's see what the penalty is. <laughs> The burn returner was killed on that play. The coach will replace him with another player. And it's first and ten. Second down in a lot. Oh, look at this guy break tack. Oh, and he breaks free and has nothing but open field in front of him. First down. Give this guy a few catches and watch his confidence take off. He is deadly in the open field, Bricks. And it's first and ten. And that's another turnover for the defense. And he's off to the races. And he just wrestles away from that tackle. He's at the... Well, he won't be waking up anytime soon. And if he does, he'll probably wake up in his own wake. That would really kill the sober mood of a wake, wouldn't it? It would freak everybody out. First and ten. Hot. Hot one. Hot two. Hot. And he's able to grab that one somehow and hold on for the first down. This guy has a nice set of hands, Grim. It's the third set of hands he's had so long today. Looks like it's a good fit. Hot one. Hot. Ah, another interception. Geez, you give this guy a big Oh, ball. that was a big hit. Hey, Bricks, I bet you took a lot of shots like that over your career. Ah, uh, let's see. About a quarter after three, Grim. But my watch is a bit slow. <laughs> and it's first and ten. Well, I personally think the ginormous guy is compensating for something, but I won't be the one to tell him. No doubt about it, that guy is dead. He says, I'm taking you with me. 
fumbles it, Bricks. That was a screwed up play if I ever saw one. The offense is down to their last running back. They lose him. They lose all their running plays. And it's first and ten. That's a four-yard gain. Second down and six. Oh, and he might have just saved a touchdown on that deflection. Third down and six. And with another pick, the QB says, I don't know almost throw it. Oh, what a punishing hit that was. And that's how you make a gun. And if you don't understand why refs are hated even more than kickers, <laughs> well, there's your answer, Bricks. Which I know, I hate those zebra men. And it's first and ten. Defense says enough of this BS and jumps off sides to lay waste to the referee. Way to go, guys. <laughs> And it's first and ten. And he just nailed him right on the numbers for a touchdown. Now, there are some who would argue that we should just skip this step and make touchdowns worth seven. What, and kick the kicker's job in half? They'd just be called sinners then. It goes right through. Yeah, like a double stuffed burrito from Taco Hell. The home team is feeling confident as they get the kickoff into the air. Scoring makes anyone confident. It certainly does, Bricks. It certainly does. High five. <laughs> Boom, dead and down. Send a message with that hit. Yeah, the message was you can't kill the messenger because he's going to kill you. But then he won't be able to read the message because the messenger killed him. Ah, I'm going in circles. The burn returner was maimed by the opposing team, so it's up to the next man to replace him. Yeah, what exactly is a burn returner, Grim? You know, players who catch kickoffs and punts and run them back through the teeth of the defense. They have the lowest survivability rate of any player in the league. The next man up just said back down. And it's first and ten. And he reels that one in for a first down to keep the drive alive. And it's first and ten. Sure, now he catches it. I had this guy on my fantasy team last week. I lost so much money on him, not to mention my kneecaps. My loan shark is very anal about collecting my money on top. And the defense jumps outside, and the whistle blows the play dead, along with the quarterback. And it's first and ten. Hot, hot one, hot two, hot three. Oh, man, what a throw. That sonic blast, and he breaks away. Holy mother of mutant mayhem, he scored! <laughs> hey, you see that move, baby? No, you didn't. You know why? It's not too fast for it. I'm the greatest, the greatest, I tell you. <laughs> And these guys think kicking is for pussies, Bricks. They're going for two. Yeah, they got big balls, Grim. Yeah, bigger than yours. Two-point plays are high risk, high reward. And it just didn't pay off. Did not have balls screwed. And stupid. 
They're looking for a good return after giving up points. Let's see how they do. Yeah, let's see if they always suck or if that was just a one-time thing. And it's first and ten. And there's another. Oh, that's a vicious hit. And the crowd loves it. He just turned this guy into 300 pounds of ground mutiny. And you can't hit a guy much harder than that. And that is unfortunate. And it's first and ten. Hot one, fight. When I was playing, a guy hit me so hard, I went into a dark tunnel. Thought I saw my grandparents waving at me in the light. Turns out it was just the visitor's tunnel that he knocked me into, and it was the paramedics waving fingers in my face. Hot, 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 hot. And another interception. This quarterback is going to listen to it. He broke free and has open field in front of him. He's at the 40. Somebody get that guy a beer, because he just saved me a thousand bucks. Oh, come on, that was a cheap shot. <laughs> That's why I love this guy. And so are the fans. And it's first and ten. That's the way to move the chains. That's good for a first down. This game is all about momentum and killing. First down and six. And with another pick, the QB says, I don't always throw interceptions, but when I do, it's when the game is on the line. And if, oh, now the offense is getting kills. Oh, this is a really violent game, guys. It's fantastic. And it's first and ten. That's a catch for a ten-yard gain. Second down in inches. That ball just slides through the defense like, and he catches it for a touchdown. What a beautiful play. Well, this should be an easy chip shot extra point, but you never know with kickers. <laughs> the kick is good! No! As expected, those are pretty much just gimmies. The teams are lined up for the kickoff. He sits up for the return. Let's see if he can break one wide open. And it's first and ten. Hot one, hot two. At this rate, the QB's going to have more interceptions than completions. He could go all the way. Since when is that a penalty? Uh, since now, I guess, Grim. First down and inch it. It's a jailbreak. And the defense jumps offside to kill the ref. Oh, crowd's loving it. Yeah, we 
First and ten. Hot, hot one, hot two. Eight. First down. I see this guy drop a lot of balls in the past, but I heard the quarterback threaten to throw him a real. The third quarter has ended, and we'll need a huge rally or a high death toll to make this one interesting. And it's first and ten. Hot, hot one, hot two, hot. point with multiple interceptions the QB should just throw in the towel boom and like the Titanic his ship just went down hey hey I almost got that mutant bingo all I need is 77 to bite it and it's first and ten I personally think that the ginormous guy is compensating for And the quarterback finds his man for the first Oh, man, he just killed that guy when the play was over. Well, if the ref didn't see it, at least the mortician did. He's coming out in the field now. And it's first and ten. And the quarterback drills one in for the first down. First down and one. Oh, the defender almost picked off the ball on that one. And that'll bring up second and one. And that's another pick. Man, oh, man. Oh, the unstoppable force meets the explodable object. <laughs> I like this. They're going for two. for the death blow. Speaking of ham sandwiches, I'm gonna go grab one. You want anything? No, I'm still working on my salami here, Briggs. Thanks. That's what she said. Ah, ah, didn't work that time. It was close, though. Yeah. The offense has only one quarterback left. If he dies, it's game over. Ah, this new QB, he don't even look too confident. He's bleeding with the coach on the sidelines about something. Yeah, he's telling his coach to punt. What a pussy. They need a good return here to set up the offense. Looks like he'll be able to run this one back if he's not terrified for his life. He is, but he's got no choice. And it's first and ten. Second down in a very lot. And he sends him to the ground with an exclamation point. And a well-placed cleat. Third down and eight. They call the war speed dirty brick. He's so fast. And he stayed with the receiver and deflected the ball. Boring, but smart. Time to punt. Whoa, whoa, you can't say that on the radio. 
And he booted a high arcing rainbow. And he snags the punt and looks for open feet. Oh, what a great defensive play that was, Bricks. Kind of like your Aunt Bertha. This guy has some big balls. What a hit. Yeah, she does have a big pair, Grim. You're right. Don't you just love the sound of bones snapping and cracking? Oh, mama. Just call him Captain Crunch. Another one bites the dust. And it's first and ten. And into the end zone for a touchdown! Once he got his hands on that pass, he went off to the races. They're going for two points. <laughs> the home crowd isn't impressed with that showing, but their team has a chance to respond. First and ten. Well, one yard is better than nothing, but not by much. Second down and nine. He's got his beast boost board. He's leaving a wake of destruction in his path, and the body toll continues to climb. Oh, holy Montezuma's revenge. That's a crap your pants and die tackle. Oh, that Montezuma was very vengeful, wasn't he, Bricks? Wonder what made him so mad. Yeah, it was probably all the diarrhea. Yeah, you're probably right. Yeah, they probably ran out of toilet paper when he was in some all-inclusive resort, and he just got so mad and cursed everyone who came to Mexico forever to crap their pants. Uh, sounds like he didn't really think it through, because, you know, he should have made it specifically for the owners of the inclusives, but you know, not the guests. What the fuck are you talking about? Uh, right now what day is it oh and that one's gonna hurt he may not be able to comprehend math after that hit what's math exactly no well, they couldn't pick up a first down so now they have to punt And he put all of his foot into that one. He's got the ball now. Let's see what he does with it. If that hit didn't cripple him, it certainly left skid marks. And it's first and ten. You've got to catch that. Second down and ten. And there's another pick. Man, this quarterback must have learned a lot about sharing when he was in school. Yeah, that's why he's so popular. Ooh, that hit's going to shave a few days off his life. First and ten. That ball was almost intercepted. Second down and ten. Oh, the defender 
almost picked off the ball on that one. Third down and 10. The receiver didn't stand a chance. Time to see if this is an elite kicker. Can he kick through a cement wall? And yeah, probably not, Bricks. Then he's not elite. It goes right through. Yeah, like a double stuffed burrito from Taco Hell. <laughs> Let's see if they can keep the momentum going and keep these fans happy and uh, or bloodthirsty, whichever. Oh, man, he really worked. And like Bricks' bowels, he is loose and heading for the end zone. He could go all the way. And it's first and ten. It's not too often a quarterback gets rejected. That's why that's the position I originally tried out for. I want to know what it's like for other people to accept you. Now that went from a joke to making me feel feelings. Stop it. This isn't a place to feel feelings. This is football. And another interception. This quarterback is going to listen to Joy Division and weep tonight. Mm, it helps. Oh, with the brain scrambler. And it's first and ten. I don't know whose eyes the QB is using, but can we get him some new ones? He broke free and has open field in front of him. The ref calls a penalty. You know, the NFL has eliminated almost every penalty in the rule book, and yet it still feels like there's way too many penalties. Stupid jerks. You guys suck. Yeah. First down and three. And he snags it for six. Touchdown! Touchdown! Okay, nice and easy like a two-foot putt. You miss two-foot putts all the time, Grim. Straight through the uprights. When you give up points, you need to get them back. Here comes the kickoff. Let's see if they can make them pay. This guy's a brick shithouse. And the offense goes into the hurry-up formation to try to conserve time. That's a six-yard gain on that catch. And that'll be... And he takes a timeout here. They have two left. I wonder if he has a plan. Well, maybe he's just going to take the teeth out of the back of his neck that have been stuck there since the opening play. Second time out, that's how you do it. Do what? The offense changes the pace by going into a hurry up. Does that mean the defense gets into a hurry up too? Grim, can I kill him? At this point with Mo Oh, and he just left an outline on the ground like he was trying to wipe out the dinosaurs. Must be opposite day because he's the one who just got wiped out. With me? Well, you mistaken, man. You get up in my grill, I'm gonna ruin your world. I'm gonna wreck it. And it's 
first and ten. His cleats are caked in blood and guts, and he's looking to score. The Simpsonasty Mangles get mangled today in a devastating home loss. They fought tooth and nail, but in the end, lose by three. It's a hell of a thing losing at home. They took away all they've got and all they're ever gonna have. Yeah, well, they played like shit. Fuck them. Fuck them indeed, Junior. Let's get out of the field and see what that meathead has to say about his MVP award. <laughs> Once again, the folks at Evil SN thank our viewing audience and the Mutant Football League for allowing us to telecast this sports presentation. This is Grim Blitzrow with Brickhead Mulligan and Bricks Jr. signing off. Today's game was brought to you by Comcrack Entertainment. They're not happy until you're not happy. <laughs>